All right, guys. I'm excited to do this one. Um, I'm a big fan of Tom McDonald. I disagree with a lot of the things he says, but I fully support his right to speak it. Um, now, he's also got a song called Fake Woke where he says facts don't care about your feelings, which is a kind of like a notorious Ben Shapiro clip. You know, he's going back and forth with a, a you know, some college student at one of these forums, and he's like, well, facts don't care about your feelings because the, the student was like, well, I feel like... So, I'm curious, man. I'm curious to see what I I want to see Ben Shapiro rap, man. The only time I've seen him rap is when he was uh quoting uh WAP or WAP or whatever, you know, the the Cardi B song. Let's get right into it, man. Tom McDonald, Ben Shapiro, facts. Here we go. They call me offensive, controversial. There's only two genders, boys and girls. They can't cancel my message because I'm the biggest independent rapper in the whole freaking world. Claim that I'm racist, yeah, all right. I'm not ashamed because I'm white. If every Caucasian's a bigot, I guess every Muslim's a terrorist. Every liberal is right. I don't want to talk to folks who don't get it. Go, whoa, go, Hey, man, I also agree with a lot. Like, that's the thing. You're not supposed to agree with every word someone says. You know, you're not supposed to agree 100% with, with a human being. You're supposed to have differences, man. So I agree with a lot and I disagree with a lot. Let's keep going, man. Bigot, I guess every Muslim's a terrorist. Every liberal is right. I don't want to talk to folks who don't get it. Go, whoa, go, broke. No hope is pathetic. Pro-choice pronouns. Pro love, you're progressive. But you ain't pro-gun. No one to protect it. Where the hey, you man. He said you have all these ideologies, but you're not pro-gun. So who's going to protect it, man? Good point. Good point. Here we go. When people would hang those, they've been taken down. They all been replaced with BLM flags or a rainbow. The same rap, the same money, cars and clothes. We ain't selling drugs. We ain't gonna overdose. Hey, man. I I love to see that message, dude. I'm I'm gonna pause it way too much of this, so I'll, I'll try to keep it at a minimum. But I just love to see that message, dude. Like he's. The thing I like most about Tom McDonald isn't his message. It's not that he exercises freedom of speech. It's the fact that his subject matter is it's not booty rhymes. He's not talking about drugs, guns, violence, overdosing. I mean, that's the thing I like most about him. And then from there, you can get into the details. But the thing I like most is he's not a he's he's like he said, the biggest independent. He's got to be the biggest independent. I can't think of. um anyone else that's as big as him who's independent man it's it's really remarkable what he's been able to do and um man i appreciate the hell out of it ain't money cars and clothes we ain't selling drugs we ain't gonna overdose we ain't pushing guns ain't promoting strip of poles we won't turn your sons into thugs or your daughters into holes hey i don't care if i offend you dude i'm i can't get dude I can't get over the fact that Ben Shapiro is next to Tom McDonald on a song, man. This is too weird, man. This is too weird of a world we live in, man. It's cool to see, though. It's cool to see. I was put here to upset you. You can cry and you can scream. You can riot in the streets. You defunded the police. Now there's no one to protect you. I hope I offend you. I ask myself what would Ben do. Wow, man. So he's saying he doesn't ask what would Jesus do. He asks what would Ben do. Interesting, man. Just keep it real facts. Don't care how you feel, man. If you want my pronouns, I'm the man. I'm the man who don't respect. Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Liz and my pockets are fat. Oh, yeah. Man. <laughs> dude, I, this is going to be a weird one, man. I don't know how I'm going to get through this, dude. He said, my pockets are, are Lizzo, or what, what did he say? They're like, Lizzo, my pockets are fat. This is weird, man. But hey, dude, Ben Shapiro built up a really um, strong infrastructure with the Daily Wire. That's one thing that people don't realize is he kind of, my understanding is that that's his own kind of independently owned thing, um, news news source, if you will. Um, yeah, man, interesting. Man who don't respect Let's look at the stats I've got the facts My money like Lizzo My pockets are fat Homie I'm epic Don't be a whap Dog it's a yarmulke Homie no cap Look at the graphs Look at my charts You're blowing money On strippers and cars You go into prison I'm on television Dog no one knows who you are Keep hating on me On the internet My comment section All woke Karen's And I make racks Off compound interest Y'all live with your parents Nikki takes <laughs> 
Dude, is this ha- is this real right now? This this is unreal, man. Notes. I just did this for fun. All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. This ain't red. This ain't. <laughs> Dude, I can't I can't get over this, man. I can't get over the fact that Ben Shapiro's trying to rap right now, man. I mean, obviously, I don't know if if. I'm I'm curious if Ben wrote this by himself or if Tom helped him out, man. I am I'm genuinely curious about um like the no cap. I wonder I wonder if Tom helped him out with a few things like, hey, you could you you know throw this in there. Let's just take a second to acknowledge how strange this is, man. But hey, dude, I am a big believer in, in freedom of speech, and um I I am not a fan of people saying you know well I feel like I feel like it's like. Do you feel it or do you think it? Do you feel it or do you believe it? And to me, it's a way of not taking ownership of of what you're saying. It's like, because if if someone says, oh, I feel like dot, 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 you can't say you're wrong because then, well, I'm not wrong for feeling that way. I can't help how I feel. It's like, well, how about you have a thought then? I can't have a a legitimate conversation with someone who just feels stuff. Shit. I'll say it. Shit. You can't just feel shit. It's like, well, well, what do you think about it? What do you believe? What, what are you? What's your code of ethics? You know? Let's keep going, man. Ain't money, cars and clothes. We ain't selling drugs. We ain't gonna overdose. We ain't pushing guns. Ain't promoting stripper poles. We won't turn your sons into thugs or your daughters into hoes. I don't care if I offend you. I was put here to upset you. You can cry and you can scream. You can ride in the streets. You can find in the Man, I mean, dude, the defunding the I was talking to someone recently, man. Like, defund the police, dude. What are you talking about? What's next? The military? Oh, we let's get rid of the military. Like, what what are we doing here, people? Like, come on, man. I like that, man. Yeah, man, so... Yeah, man. Tom McDonald and Ben Shapiro. You know, I I know they did an interview a little bit before this. um, And so they must have talked at some point like, hey, man, would you want to do a collaboration? Which I think it's cool. Um, I think it's cool to see that uh, fusion between music and, uh, you know, the political commentary realm. Um, Once again, man, you know, for me, it's like. I don't agree with everything Tom or or, or Ben has to say. Um, now I I do agree with a lot of things that that they have to say, but um, personality wise, they they're pretty similar. Um, but it is a little shocking because Ben Shapiro's um a lot more. I mean he he's a I want to say he's he's an Orthodox Jew, and so he's you, you know he practices that, so he's pretty socially conservative in that like appearing on a screen with a. Uh, a guy with face tattoos tatted up all over, you know, crazy dreads and whatnot. Um, it, it wouldn't be what you would expect from a guy like Ben Shapiro to hop on a rap beat with, you know, with a guy with dreads, uh, a white dude with dreads and face tattoos, you know. But um, it's cool to see them get together. And I didn't see how their interview went, but I do know that obviously Tom McDonald, um, I mean, all the way back to Fake Woke, uh, his song Fake Woke, and probably before that, um was a fan of ben shapiro because i i listened to fake woke and he was like facts don't care about your feelings and i was like hey man so he he obviously keeps an ear to the political realm um you know and and ultimately it doesn't really matter to me 
how much I disagree with this person or agree with that person, but I do feel it necessary to say, you know, I, I agree with some things and I disagree with others. Um, just cause you know, I've, I've noticed that if you say you're a fan of Tom McDonald, people assume like, Oh, you're like a Trump supporting, like gun toting, like let's raid the Capitol kind of person. Um, like that's kind of the assumption. So I do feel it necessary. Unfortunately, I, I do feel it's somewhat necessary to say like, yeah, there are things I agree on, things I don't agree on. Some things I'm like, Hey, that's crazy, man. What are you talking to? That's off the wall. And then other things I'm like, right on, man. So Cool to see, man. Cool to see. I can't believe these two got together, dude. That's so nuts, man. I I'm curious. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna read some comments, man. If you guys want to stick around and see me read some comments, we'll do it. Tom McDonald, what do you think? La di da di da. He said, "Let's get on a number one on a billboard." My money like Lizzo. My pockets are fat. I actually like that line, man. Can Ben do a thing where he plays his violin and <laughs> raps at the same time? Yeah, does anyone know if Ben wrote his own lyrics? Yeah, thank you, man. I'm liking that comment because I'm curious if, if Ben sat down and wrote that. Um, I'm guessing Ben wrote it and then maybe consulted um, with Tom McDonald on it. That would be my guess. Hearing Ben rap is bringing me back to my ep rap, <laughs> epic rap battle of history days. Yeah, man, because their, their rap is super robotic and nasally and, and crusty, you know? Yeah. Um, Man, I'm kind of disappointed that Ben didn't rap faster. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, he Ben rapped slower than he talks. That's that's kind of funny. That's a funny point, man. But hey, I'm just going to I'm just going to post this reaction up, man. I thought it was uh cool to see. So, um, I'll post it up and uh whoever likes it likes it, man. Feel free to hit sub, like, comment on the video, you know. Um, I read all the comments. I don't respond to all of them, but I'll wrap this one up. You guys take care, stay safe, um wherever you're watching the video from. Thank you.